Exodus 35, it's Moses gathering the people for the Sabbath. Listen to this verse. It says, Then Moses gathered all the congregation of the children of Israel together, and he said to them, These are the words which the Lord has commanded you to do. Work shall be done for six days, but the seventh day shall be a holy day for you, a Sabbath of rest to the Lord. So he's teaching them, he's instructing them to set apart a day, the Sabbath a day to honor the Lord, to obey the Lord, and to rest in the Lord. And there's some great lessons for us in this chapter. Exodus chapter 35 deals with the Sabbath, but also he tells them about the instruments and the building of the tabernacle. So the building of the tabernacle has to do with them giving, giving what they can, what they have. And it's not a compulsory giving, it's just whatever you have to give, give so we can build the tabernacle. And Moses is teaching them what well, kind of what the Lord teaches us, that we're to serve, that we're to rest in Him, that we're to honor Him, that we're to obey Him, and that we're to give that which He has given to us. And the tabernacle will be built, and there will be a day that they set aside to rest in the Lord. It's actually a great shadow, if you will, of the body of Christ, how together we serve, together we observe a time together where we worship and honor the Lord but also the body of Christ, our resources, our giftings, our treasures, our talents, our honor to the Lord. It's all pictured, if you will, it's all seen here in the keeping of the Sabbath and the building of the tabernacle. As you and I build this holy spiritual place, the body of Christ, the temple of the Lord, as we worship together and serve together and give together, it's Exodus chapter 35 but it's alive and it's real today, and that which is called the church.